but it does not like I'm going to get a swim in today. So some days it happens, you plan and the elements go against you. Either it's too torrent on the water or there's no access in or out, so you have to be safe. Is the Devil's Bridge over spanning, or spanning the River Loon, but unfortunately it looks a bit white water, so I don't think I'll be swimming here. So we're going to have another look further down towards Lancaster, but it's gorgeous there. Built in the 13th century. As you know, I haven't done many river swims. Well, I only did one short one by Elta Water. But, trying to get to swim in the River Loon. I'm trying to find somewhere safe for a um, very steep embankment. And quite, still quite, quite a bit of a current as well. So, just keep walking along this river and see where we, what we can see. Lots of dogs barking in the distance. Quite a few border collies. <laughs> I miss my Riley. The birds that are flying around are sand martins, not house martins, and they've got little nests in the sandbanks on the river. So we're just watching them fly around and see if they go back to their little nests but it does not like I'm going to get a swim in today so some days it happens you plan and the elements go against you either it's too torrent on the water or there's no access in or out so you have to be safe to come to Bleetarn. Lovely Bleetarn to end the day. Oh, I started off at Devil's Bridge in Kirby Lonsdale. Whitewater rafting is not my thing. Then we went to Crookaloon and again the sides were steep. The best things about that was the San Martins coming out of the, um, the sandbanks. Then we decided to drive and I was here, finally got, luckily got parking and we're going to go for a swim, hopefully. Easter Bunny is out again, this time at Fleet Tarn.
little blue tie in eight degree water.